leaving Paris and I'm heading a little bit outside to go to the town of Giverny where Monet's from and also see the Palace of Versailles which is one of the most extravagant palaces in the world. This place used to be only used for royal summer retreats and hunting grounds until Louis XIV came along and transformed it into a palace. The palace has over a hundred rooms. My favorite room of all is the Hall of Mirrors. It's this long domed hallway with chandeliers and the ceiling is painted. I'm in the Garden of Versailles right now and this place is gigantic. There are over 15 of these huge fountains. Throughout the day, they have these fountain shows where everyone gathers around. It's almost like a concert. The classical music starts playing and the water starts going. Then you wander around the little labyrinth and you find these little hidden gems like this one right here. I'm just outside Paris in Giverny, which is famous because Monet lived here and I'm going to go check out his gardens. Monet moved to Giverny to escape the bustling Paris city life. And in the 40 years that he lived there, he painted his famous Impressionist paintings of landscapes and rural scenes. Being here, I feel like I'm walking through one of Monet's paintings. I'm looking over the lily pond right now, which was an inspiration for one of his most famous paintings. I'm standing in front of Monet's house where he lived with his wife and his 10 children, and it overlooks this huge, gigantic garden of flowers. This place is impressive. This is where he got most of his inspiration for his paintings. Today was a great day. I got to get out of the city and see Giverny and Versailles.